Assalamualaikum and very good morning. Our lesson today is likelihood ataupun keboleh jadian. So, what is the likelihood? Likelihood is the possibility or probability of an event to occur. Keboleh jadian ialah kemungkinan atau kebarangkalian sesuatu peristiwa itu berlaku. An event can either be an event that is possible to occur or an event that is impossible to occur. Sesuatu peristiwa itu terdiri daripada peristiwa yang mungkin berlaku, possible to occur ataupun impossible to occur, tidak mungkin berlaku. Okey, jadi kena faham. The likelihood is ada dua perkara. First, possible to occur ataupun the second is impossible to occur. Boleh jadi atau tidak boleh jadi. Okay. So let's go to example. State whether the following event is possible to occur or impossible to occur and then give your reason. Sila nyatakan sama ada peristiwa berikut yang bawah empat ini A B C D E ini possible to occur ataupun impossible to occur. Okay. A There are 31 days in a month. Ada 31 hari dalam sebulan. Possible or not possible? Or impossible? And then give your reason lah. Okay, B. Chickens can give birth. C. 10 can be divided exactly by 4 without remainder. And D. National Day falls on a Friday. So, let's go to the answer. A. There are 31 days in a month. Possible or impossible? Ya, yeah, possible to occur. Why? Kenapa? Sebab there are few months that have 31 days. Ada beberapa bulan yang mempunyai 30 hari dalam bulan tersebut. For example, January, March, May, July, August, October, December. Okay? B. Chickens can give birth. Adakah ayam itu boleh melahirkan anak? Impossible. So, the answer is impossible. Mustahil ayam boleh melahirkan anak. Because why? Chickens reproduce by laying eggs. Ayam, dia tidak boleh melahirkan anak tetapi ayam membiak secara bertelur. Okay. C. 10 can be divided exactly by 4 without remainder. Adakah nombor 10 itu boleh dibahagi tepat dengan 4 tanpa ada baki? So, the answer is impossible. Because why? Bila kita buat work out, 10 divide 4, we get 2, remainder 2. Ada remainder 2. D. National Day falls on a Friday. Hari kebangsaan itu jatuh pada hari Jumat. Possible or impossible? The answer is possible to occur. Why? Because Friday is one of the days in a week. Okay, mungkin juga National Day tu falls on Monday, Tuesday. Tapi ada juga Friday. Lainlah kalau Friday itu tidak tersenarai dalam hari-hari dalam seminggu. Okay? Okay, so likelihood of an event. Likelihood of... Likelihood of an event, there are five likelihoods of an event that you must know, which is certain, impossible, equally likely, least likely, and most likely. Ada lima likelihood ataupun kebol keboleh jadian sesuatu peristiwa itu yang perlu anda faham. Certain, impossible, equally likely, least likely, and most likely. Okey, kita bergerak kepada maksud kepada lima lima likelihood itu tadi. Okey, so uh, please look at the jadual dan abaikan abaikan yang peratus ini di sebelah kiri ini. Okey, first certain certain kalau dalam bahasa Melayu kita sebut sebagai pasti. Okey, certain means is an event will occur. Sesuatu peristiwa itu confirm akan berlaku. Okey. 100% akan berlaku ok most likely ataupun besar kemungkinan most likely is the biggest possibility for an event to occur 
Ataupun most likely ini ialah kemungkinan sesuatu peristiwa itu berlaku adalah lebih besar. Okay. Equally likely. Equally likely ataupun sama kemungkinan is either possible for an event to occur or impossible to occur. Dia sama ada. Sesuatu peristiwa itu mungkin berlaku atau mungkin tidak berlaku. And then, least likely ataupun kecil kemungkinan is the smallest possibility for an event to occur. Kemungkinan berlaku sesuatu peristiwa itu adalah kecil. Okay? Kalau tadi ada most likely, ini least likely, dia peristiwa itu mau berlaku tu macam alamak. 20% maybe ataupun 10% sedikit saja peratus untuk dia berlaku dan di bawah sekali ataupun yang kelima is impossible mustahil impossible is not likely an event to occur peristiwa itu tidak mungkin berlaku mustahil dia berlaku so kalau kamu lihat di sebelah kiri ni adalah satu peratus daripada bawah hingga ke atas okey peratus ini apa Peratus ini maksudnya uh, berapakah peratus sesuatu event itu will occur or not occur. Berapakah peratus sesuatu peristiwa itu boleh berlaku atau tidak. So, we start from bottom. Impossible, 0%. Mustahil sesuatu peristiwa itu berlaku. Okay. Least likely, jadi peratus dia between 1 until 49 lah. Okay. And then equally likely. 50%, 50-50. Okay, sama ada jadi atau tidak. Most likely, 51% until 99%. Besar kemungkinan berlaku. And then, certain 100% will occur. 100% akan berlaku. So, we go to the example. Okay. State the likelihood for each of the following event. And then give you reason. Okay. Nyatakan sama ada keboleh jadian bagi setiap peristiwa berikut dan bagi sebab anda. A. In a year, there are 365 days. Dalam satu tahun, ada 365 hari. Okay. So, yang ini, okay kelas. So, yang ini, kamu perlu nyatakan dia punya likelihoods yang ada lima tadi. There are five likelihoods, certain, most likely, Equally likely, least likely and impossible. So, kamu kena bagi tahulah mana satu penyataan ini dan mana satu dia punya likelihood keboleh jadian dia. B. Malaysia Day is celebrated on every 31 August. Hari kemerdekaan Malaysia ataupun Hari Malaysia, bukan Hari Kemerdekaan. Hari Kemerdekaan National Day. Malaysia Day ialah Hari Malaysia disambut pada setiap 31 Ogos. Okay, see humans need oxygen to breathe. Manusia memerlukan oksigen untuk bernafas. D, getting prime numbers from tossing a dice. Okay, apakah possibility ataupun keboleh jadian mendapat nombor perdana daripada lambungan sebiji dadu? Bila kita lambung sebiji dadu, apa kebarangkalian kita mendapat nombor perdana? Okay. Okay, for those yang tidak tahu the dice, the dice have uh, six numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Okay, so kamu kena tentukan mana satu prime numbers and which one is not a prime numbers. And E, earthquake occurs in Malaysia. Adakah gempa bumi ini berlaku di Malaysia? So, nyatakan sama ada certain ke, impossible ke. Okay, so the answer. Ah, dia ada jawapan di sebelah ini. For A, in a year, there are 365 days. Yeah, most likely. Okay, besar kemungkinan. Because number of days in a year is 365 except for leap years. Melainkan pada tahun lompat. Okay, kalau tahun lompat, dia akan bertambah satu hari. Okay. So, uh, B. Malaysia Day is celebrated on every 31 August. Hari Malaysia disambut pada 31 Ogos. What is the likelihood? Apakah keboleh jadian? The answer is impossible. Mustahil. Because why? Malaysia Day falls on 16 September. 
Okay, 31 August itu adalah National Day. So, Malaysia Day is 16 September. Iaitu combination ataupun gabungan Sabah Sarawak dengan Semenanjung. C. Humans need oxygen to breathe. Okay, manusia memerlukan oksigen untuk bernafas. Betul atau tidak? Pasti atau tidak? Ya, yeah, the answer is certain. Pasti. Because why humans will die if there is no oxygen for breathing. Manusia akan mati kalau tidak oksigen. Jadi, kebolehjadian manusia memerlukan oksigen itu adalah pasti. 100%. D. Getting prime numbers from tossing a dice. Okay, the answer is equally likely. Because why? Prime numbers on a dice are 3, I, sorry, 2, 3 and 5. While 1, 4 and 6 are not prime numbers. Kalau kita lihat di sini, a dice, dia ada 6 numbers, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Then, there are 3 prime numbers. 3 prime numbers and 3 not a prime numbers. 50, orang kata, 50% prime numbers, 50% not a prime numbers. So, the probability or the likelihood is equally likely. And then E, earthquake occurs in Malaysia. Gempa bumi berlaku di Malaysia. The answer is least likely. Because why? Malaysia is out of the earthquake zone. Okay. Keboleh jadian gempa bumi berlaku di Malaysia adalah Kecil kemungkinan. Berlaku juga tetapi kecil kemungkinan. Dan anda perlu nyatakan sebab why least likely. Kenapa kecil kemungkinan? Because Malaysia is out of the earthquake zone. Kalau Malaysia itu berada dalam uh, zone earthquake ataupun dalam zone berlakunya gempa bumi, ha, maka the answer may be most likely, most likely lah. Okay, besar kemungkinan. Okay, example 2. So, example 2 ni, I think kamu boleh pause. And then, kamu baca the question here. Sebelah kiri ni, question. And then, after that, kamu baca jawapan dia di sini. Okay? So, that's all for today. Thank you.